Grinding is a rather rough process. We all know when we finish composite surfaces, for example, then we have a resin matrix which keeps those glass particles in place. And when we now use our diamonds, we might crack little glass particles out of that matrix. And therefore, we really have to go down the finishing and polishing to be sure that there is no micro gaps on the surface. But you know, in everyday dentistry, sometimes you know we have those micro gaps and then we have discoloration etc and let's say this is all based on grinding and this is what we do however grinding and CAD CAM is always also used for let's say ceramics and also there we have to be very careful because as I said it's a rough process we have to be careful regarding cracks or you know uh, having later on probably ceramic chipping off of a, of a framework etc and um, well, lasering is a very smooth process. It's a very precise process. Uh, with laser, you can you know cut, you can melt, and you can coat surfaces. And so, as we talked about composites having a resin matrix with let's say glass fillers involved, using the laser entering those surfaces, so to speak, sintering the glass inside, and finally coating a layer of glass on top of it is kind of creating an unorganic smooth surface which we normally only know by let's say the glaze burn of a ceramic crown and so that's why we say this is the best out of two worlds because of course composite offers very positive aspects as it is as i mentioned mechanically wise um, yeah something which mimics nature in a very good way and we know ceramic is much harder it's more brittle and therefore, as we mentioned before, the indication field is more narrow. So this really opens, uh, let's say, the indication to everywhere where we normally would have used, let's say, direct techniques. But with this technology, we have increased the quality. And this is just something which we cannot achieve by hand.